Good morning, welcome to Planet Mojo. I'm gonna do a little update on this carb rebuild because there's a problem. This shaft right here, the shaft on here was all mangled up and when I tried getting it apart, it just broke in half. So what I did was I ordered a new shaft online to match the old shaft. And this is it. And with this in place, you can get the choke plate in there. But no matter what, it's going to be closed when it's at the stop. I finally found a video online. It, it was just a 3D video, not an actual carb, but it shows them inserting the choke plate and turning it to the stop and putting the spring on. Everything exactly the same, except this slot is, it, like if you're laying it down, like that, the slot is turned 90 degrees so that the choke is normally open. So there is your problem. Whoever rebuilt this carburetor the last time must have gotten the wrong shaft, like this shaft that is normally closed. There must be an application for that. You know, they make them and you can buy them online but that's not the right shaft for this carburetor. They make hundreds of different versions of these and this one needs that, that slot at a slightly different angle. So what I did is ordered a new rebuild kit and the rebuild kit that I ordered has all of the parts including this here and new springs, the whole nine yards. So I'm just going to take this apart again and put it together with the new rebuild kit. It also includes the screws here. I'm going to take it apart, put it back together with uh, the other stuff. I'll save all this stuff, but... <sighs> and I'll do a new video on it. I took down the old videos and I'm going to try to do it all in one video maybe have some pieces of the original video with the cleaning of the carb but the entire assembly i'm going to do with the new kit so like i said i took down the old video and i will put it back up as soon as the new kit gets here and i replace this choke with the correct choke shaft and I, that kit includes uh a choke plate and the spring and all the screws yeah it was $13 more I didn't want to spend the money and if I would have spent the money I would have found out that this had the wrong equipment in it to start with okay so watch for that that's probably gonna be 10 12 days it takes a while for that to get here so when it gets here I'm gonna redo this and Hopefully we can get that tractor started and get it out of the shed real soon. So if you want to see that, make sure you subscribe and click on the update icon. If you have any questions or comments, make sure you put them in the comment section below. And if you share the video and or give it a like, it helps the channel out greatly. Thanks for watching and have a great day.